Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Splatoon 3. Today, it's time for the spooky Splatoween. Unfortunately, I won't be here when it is time for the Splatfest. I'll have to miss it this time. I just won't be home to record it. So I do want to showcase that there is a Splatoween themed Splatfest um, and we get to choose our team. Either a zombie would be, be the best friend, a skeleton would be the best friend, or a ghost would be the best friend. And out of the three, I think a ghost would be the best friend. So I'll join this team, but like I said, I just won't have the time. I wish I could, but I physically will not be here to record it, so I can't. But what we will be doing is we'll be going to the lobby and going to the lobby terminal because there is some brand new Splatoon themed gear. I figure as a constellation, I'll check this stuff out and that'll be pretty cool, right? So if we run over here, um, we have some new stuff and look at all this very, very cool. So we got some cool new gear. We'll be checking it out in just a couple of rounds with each of them and we can also customize our splash tag. I'll go ahead and equip it now and we got some DLC rewards. Whoa, okay, cool. So we got a new uh, Pearl and Marina banner. That's cool. I think that's unrelated, but um, yeah, let's go ahead and check this stuff out. So if we go over here and equip, we have our first headpiece right over here. This is the undead head. Whoa, it's like a mummy wrap. Very, very cool. So we'll equip that one. We'll do, I think, maybe like two rounds each with each one of these. So we'll have four in total to check out. And I'll try to choose some other pieces of gear that'll go well with it. Uh, I don't know if I have too much that would look like a mummy wrap, but maybe at least something that matches the color a bit better. Uh, we'll take a look around though and we'll find out. I think the setup we actually had right here isn't too bad. We got the tri-shred tee where it's all ripped up and the white lover high tops, sort of matching with the same color. You know what, we'll keep with this one. And for emotes, I don't know if we have anything that screams undead, but uh, there we go. We sort of, I don't know, maybe, maybe not. Uh, huh. Lots of options. Okay, we're cold, there we go. We're cold because we don't have a hard beat anymore. Spooky, very cool, very cool. We'll play a little bit as the era sprays. We hop into some action. What do we have for regular Battle Turf? Well, we have Mincemeat Metalworks and Flounder Heights. All right, so we're starting our action out here on Flounder Heights. Let's give it a go. Hopefully we can uh, get some terrifying victories or something like that. I'm trying to pump in as many Halloween puns as I can. If not anything else, my gameplay might be terrifyingly bad because I have not played in a good long while, so I'll try to keep up with everything today, and if we don't do the best, I apologize, but we don't play Turf War too much on Mincemeat Metalworks, so it'll be fun to fill up this map and see how it goes. Let's get up here, we do have the Booyah Bomb for this weapon. This is, of course, an all-time classic in my opinion, so it'll be cool to use it. Oh no, can I get you? I do get you, and then right over here, time for the Booyah Bomb. I think I'm just gonna toss it right there. Really try to give them some problems. I did see you over here, where did you go? Whoa, where did they go? I don't know. Uh, maybe they jumped on this way. This person really trying to catch up with me. Whoa, whoa, oh, I almost got them, but they doubled up on me there. Not so good. But hey, if we can just sort of stay active all in front of them like that, I'm sure we could win this one. There's definitely some good potential here. But we do have the sprinkler, so what we should do, right, is toss it up here. Keep them busy that way. But also, there's like this huge section here that's uncovered by both teams. Why do they have to be chasing me? Uh, here, I'm gonna wait right here. They didn't decide to go for me. Okay, never mind. Ooh. I wanna get up this way then. Whoa, hey, watch it. Not good, not good. Uh, run, run, run. Get her on the corner. I wanna burn up this Booyah Bomb as soon as possible. Cause up some issues on this side. Just like that. Nice. And then we will go back up here like this. And then, booyah bomb time. You can toss it just right down there. Nobody has touched this side either, so you know what to do. We just gotta fill it up. And then, whoa, watch it, watch it. Oh, they got me, but our teammate got them. So I'll say it's a fair trade. And there is a teleporter there that hopefully one of our teammates can get rid of. But with a minute and 20 seconds remaining, they are in danger. I think that's really good for us. We can get this stuff really cleared up. I might just hide here for a moment, but then to be a little bit more aggressive, get them knocked out, and they chase me down. Oh boy, that's okay, because the rest of our team sort of keeping them pinned back pretty well. Okay, one minute left. Let's make the most of it then. I would like to throw that there. I hear them really trying to get some people. Ooh, anybody back here? Oh, there is, gotcha, and then you. I gotta be ready for this. Whoa, hey, hey, watch it. Of course they had a teammate there. I was not ready for that. Unfortunate, but it's okay. Some of our teammates getting knocked back. I'll try to jump over to a couple of them. And go over here. Oh, I immediately get knocked out. This might be a disaster. They could push back at the very end. 
I don't know if I should jump over, but it looks like they're doing a pretty good job at figuring some stuff out, so maybe. Here, get this here. Oh, every time. I'm not really having a good ending to this round, but it looks like at least the rest of my teammates are. So with a few seconds remaining, I'm tired of jumping over for it just not to be very uh, good. I'll toss it over like this, just cover up whatever turf I can, wherever I can find it. Ooh, you know, yeah, you go over there, I'll go over here, I can cover up turf faster than you can. So there we go, I think we did win our first round, but we're gonna find out in just a moment. It's looking pretty good. All right, got them all wrapped up in our ink in a way they've been mummified. There we go, <laughs> I think we actually chose a pretty good one. All right, so there we go, our first one here with some of the Splatoween gear, looking pretty good. But of course we have more to go. I'll do one more round with this gear before we switch over to the next one. I do like the details on it. It really is like a good piece of gear. There we go, level seven. We also get an extra conch shell there. And over this way, an extra level for a white low vert high tops. All right, keep going. All right, round two will be on the other map, Mince Me Metalworks. All right, let's get back to the Splatoween action. It is really cool how they kept the tradition going with this one. Okay, so I'll toss something like that over there and just really get to work when it comes to covering up turf. We could get out there and get a Booyah Bomb earlier rather than later. I think that'd be great. Okay, heading over here. Lots of stuff to get to. And then I have my Booyah Bomb ready. I might scope it out for a moment. But if they're gonna try to get me with that, maybe I could just toss it over like that. Hopefully I don't get splatted. Somehow I don't. <laughs> Excellent. All right, go, go, go. They're throwing their own Booyah Bomb. I didn't get any splats with mine, but I do get a drink there. Nice. Okay, whoa, whoa. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Wait, there's somebody else here. Come on. Oh, did we get them? I can't really quite tell. I think so. Yeah, awesome. All right, let's get over here. I did see a little spot not covered up over there, so our sprinkler can get the job done while we make our way over here. Nice. And we're almost ready for another Booyah Bomb. So if we do something like that, I should just be able to get up here and Cause some problems for somebody. I'm gonna throw it right there. Please don't beat me up. Ah, they beat me up. Okay, that's fine. Somebody else finished them off with a booyah bomb, covered up a lot of stuff. We're definitely keeping them sort of stuck in the corner for now. I just wanna keep it that way. So we just gotta keep moving, keep playing. Keeping things pretty active here. Whoa, get that one. Oh no, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did not see them until it was too late. Maybe I just wanna jump over this time. Might be a better idea. Or not, it didn't work. Okay, they are really pushing back in a major way. Things could go south here if we're not careful. I see them over there. It looks like they're not gonna hop down now. Okay, I will just go over here. Oh, I see you, I see you, but I don't know if you saw me. Ooh, here, tossing that up there. Really just trying to cause some problems. I know that they're right behind me. Ah, oh, I was almost at the Booyah Bomb, but they knocked me out with the reflux. Very unfortunate. Come on, okay, here's our chance. Tossing that there, charging up the Booyah Bomb, and I think we'll just throw it right there. We'll see if that does anything for us. At the least, it pushes him back a little bit more, helps us regain some turf. Don't you dare. I don't know who's trying to shoot at me right now. Get rid of that sprinkler, get over on this side. They don't quite see me, right? Uh, They, they don't, sort of, but everybody else on me out. Come on, jumping over to you. More with the sprinkler, might be necessary. But we got it. Okay. Jumping up here. Might be a little bit more aggressive. Maybe a mistake. Uh, somebody else got you. Awesome. That's a good thing. I'll get that there. No, they find me around the corner. Jeez, that sinks. They got me with the air spray as well. This is pretty intense with 20 seconds remaining. There's a lot going on, but we can definitely still win this one. I just need to get some stuff out there. I think I might just want to wait for a moment. Okay, right there. When you're doing that, I'll just try to get you. I got you. Okay, this is our chance then. Huge moves, actually. I can throw the sprinkler up there, go like this, run over, and I think we get the win. Let's see, so it's two rounds with the mummy. Looking pretty good. I think we got the victory here. Boom, 51 to 41. We definitely did, so a 10.1% lead, and we get two golds and a silver. So yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about that. I think now would be a good time to not only switch our outfit, but also switch game modes. Why don't we try a little bit of ranked and see how that goes? Haven't played too much this season, so I don't know if I'll be able to keep up with the action, but I'll certainly try. So we'll back out of this. We'll get the undead head. Level up right there. Very cool. 
and we will stop for now. So that was our first Splatoween themed costume piece, but if we go to here, our equip menu, we can switch over to the next one, which is the Plankton Walker. Ooh, it's a pirate hat with, once again, lots of cool details. I love the emblem. It looks like it's like some kind of salmon, hard to tell, but um, it also has, or maybe not. Actually, it sort of looks like a, like a zebra turkey fish. Cool. Um, it has some like quills on there too. I like this one a lot. So we'll try to find some different pieces of gear that might match with that well. All right, so I think this is probably the best fit I can find. Schoolyard Scrapjack is pretty piratey to me. It's all ripped up and stuff. And then we have the Punk Knights, just some kind of boots. I feel like darker boots fit pretty well. I think this is a pretty coherent, cohesive fit. And we'll change up the weapon just for the sake of variety. I don't wanna go too crazy with changing it to something outside of my comfort zone. Uh, but I think we'll go with the Splushomatic. That feels pretty good to me. We'll hop into some action with this. And like I said, we'll try some ranks. So I'll try my best to win with whatever it is. Um, it looks like we have either Clam Blitz or Splat Zones. We'll do this one because it's not a series either way, but Brightwater Springs and Mahi Mahi Resort. Let's give it a go. All right, so we got our first round here with our pirate getup. Let's see if we can't sort of uh, steal a win here, steal some booty. Let's go for it. So, of course, it is Splat Zones. We're gonna get out there real fast. Something like that might be a good idea. And then up this way, watch out for all the, oh, I immediately get smacked down. Not good. We'll have to see how well I'm able to keep up because like I said, it's been a while since I've played. Well, I'm pretty rusty. So we'll just have to hope that our team's pretty solid and we can make the most out of it. Of course, sometimes it is a little bit of a luck of the draw just because of you know, weapon combos and stuff like that, but I can, whoa, hey, hey! <laughs> Did not see them, they were just hanging out in there. Okay, maybe not the best situation so far. I just gotta keep trying, and if I could get this hammer build up, actually, there we go, that could be a difference maker. So once again, I'll try this strategy, but I'll let them think I'm going that way. Instead, we're actually slamming over in this direction, where I can just jump up, maybe, or not. Okay, this ain't going so well. I'm getting stuck on the corner. Here, catch. I did it, no, wait, wait, it ended, it ended. Not good. Uh, I'll just hide in the corner for a second. If I could just do something extra sneaky like this, they wouldn't, no, no, they knew, they knew, they knew. I was trying to be super sneaky with it, but I think somebody spotted me. <laughs> Whoops, I was just waiting for them to jump over me with the tentabrella, then we could go just knock them out. Maybe not the best situation for super advanced strategies that I can't actually pull up because of my skill level, oh no. Uh, hiding right here for now. And then, go, 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 I saw you over here. Oh my gosh, they are just wiping the floor with me. Not good, they're wiping the poop deck with me right now. Trying to think of all the puns I can. Whether you like it or not. All right, let's go. Over here, you're in trouble. No, I'm in trouble. Oh my goodness, this is not going well. I ran into the ink mine out of anything. That really stinks. They're taking down real fast here, so we just gotta move it. Come on, go, go, go. Throw that over there. Oh, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. Just move it over this direction, then double back on them. They would never expect me to do that, right? Here we go, here we go, here's my chance for real. Here's my chance for real, I get one of them, I'm chasing down the next one, catch. It didn't work, okay, that's fine. No, I got them, no way. Did that really get them? I can't believe it, that was so cool. So, really, really good stuff there. I just wanna fill up whatever I can around this direction too. Really just trying to make it so that it's difficult for them to get back over here, because maybe we can make a huge comeback here, you never know. I would like to not get too caught up and pushing them back, because what always ends up happening is we do that, right? And then we die right at the last second and they steal it all back. So I don't want that to happen. I see this long range player over there. Uh, I'm just trying to chill back for now because one player, it just takes one player to jump off like that and then we just go, go, go. Come on, ooh, can I get you here or no? Okay, somebody got you, that's great. Let's move this over here. We've taken the lead with that, that is excellent. I wanna go back over here. Whoa, they're chasing me. Come on, splat you, splat you. Got it, got it, got it. Who is over here? Somebody, Um. oh no, oh no, come on. Here's our chance, no way, there was someone else. I feel like they have five people on their team. They're just all over the place. Come on, come on, they're back in control, but just for a moment, because we're just gonna rush over here, activate the hammer, here's my chance to knock out one of them, at the least two of them, it's a wipeout. We're back in control with it. I will toss this way over there, Never mind. it ended. Jeez, crazy stuff. We only need to take down 10 points, but to do that, we need to get through a 50 point reserve. This is a close round for sure. Okay, I need to just wait over here for a moment and see, and see. I don't know if this is the way to do this. 
hit being sneaky like that. We've lost control, actually. Whoa, whoa. I got all sorts of stuff chasing me down. I gotta move over here. They're in control, but if we can take it back like that, we're back to 50 reserve. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of work. Come on, we can do it. Oh man, he got me. Did not even see you. We lost control again, but we're t we took it back, we took it back. We're gonna jump over to somebody like this. For better or for worse, oh no. Uh, move it, move it, move it. Tossing that over there. I wanna get down this way then. And then, ooh. I'm a little bit scared, but I see you. Man, they are so fast. I can't keep up with that. <laughs> Let's see if we can't sneak around to the side. Or, I know time is ticking, but if I could just earn up the hammer, something like that, there we go. We're in control, so our teammate's able to take it away while I'm doing that. I see you over here, but do you see me, is the question. No, you don't, hammer. Get it out of here. It's a wipeout again. Every time I pull up this hammer, the rest of my team just wipes them out. They're really good at that. Toss it over. Didn't get anybody, but it could have. It's always about the potential, right? Gonna throw that up there. Whoa, hold on. A lot of players all over the place. Maybe I do go aggressive this time. Maybe I just go like this and I, wow! The moment they pulled the Trizuka, we lost control again. Only a few seconds remaining though. If we can hold out, we might be able to do it. Come on, three, two, one. It might go into overtime actually. Uh, it will go into overtime. They lost control. Here's our chance. Splat you and we win! What an intense round of splat zones. That was great. So I'm glad we got the victory there. 94 to 81, super intense. It took everyone all of their efforts, but I got triple silver here, so definitely more of the other teammates than me. All right, so with that done, as you can see, we should be getting some good experience from that, I hope. Guess we'll find out in just a moment. Got eight spots, got nine, spotted nine times, but we're jumping up to uh, 612 points. We're B plus at the moment, that's not too bad. But hey, looks like we already unlock a new ability for the Plankton Walker. Nice. All right, so we'll go for one more round with this before we switch it up again soon. All right, so let's see how this one goes. We're, we're back on uh, whatever this is, Finder Heights. It was a close round last time. Maybe this time we can actually pull out a win a little bit more decisively. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But right now I'm just focused on uh, getting this hammer figured out, but I can roll one of those down there. We're in control, and as soon as they show up, you can just try to get them, Never mind. Oh my gosh, they sent me down so easily with that. But you know, they can be from a distance like that. They're not gonna be able to get the control back too easily. We sniped the control back right from them super quick there. So because of that, we didn't have any reserve to deal with. Okay, they have a hammer player too. Luckily, they're getting dealt with. Ooh, come on, come on. I'm throwing that over there. And then I need to refill an ink. Hopefully they don't see me, they see me on now. <laughs> oh my gosh, the worst time to run out of ink is when three of the enemy teammates are looking at, right at you. All right, come on. Back in control again though. This time we have to deal with the reserve, but they've only gotten four points in. So overall, doesn't seem like we're doing so bad. I wanna get back up here, just fill up as much of this stuff as I can, uh, especially over here since this stuff is hardly touched on. Okay, I'll see you over this way. Of course, with my sploosh matic here, not gonna have too much of a reach. I'm gonna wait over here for now, because honestly, they're not really doing the best. Like, they're just not even over here. That does not reach. Okay, good to know. I'll get rid of this. They're just gonna try to hit it from a distance, but at this point, we're just slowly taking down. Oh, hey, okay, I thought they were my teammate for a moment. And as soon as they get this all covered up, I just recover it. I feel like they just maybe just had an unfortunate weapon combination here. Hammer versus hammer though, I'm chasing after you. Gotcha, awesome. And then maybe toss it over there like that. Doesn't get anybody, but it could have. Okay, now that you've done that, we just knock you out again, and that's game. That was a really, really quick round of splat zones. I was asking for decisiveness, and we got it. We plundered that one, no problem. Okay, so there's that done. Two rounds of Splat Zones with this pirate hat. I think that's good enough that we can head back to the lobby and uh, change things up again. We're not even the only pirate hat player here. We're looking good. Okay, so will we get any extra experience for all that? I would hope so, but we're about to find out. So far, so good. So it's uh, lots of solid victories so far today. There we go, we get some extra levels for these Punk Knight boots. Nice. 
Oh, we gotta level up with our catalog there. We will stop for now so that we can change our gear and see what else we can get done. So that was the pirate hat. I think we have two more uh, things. We got, also got a new badger, awesome. Uh, the swim reaper, whoa, so like a kraken type of thing. I'll try to see what we can find that fits with this. It looks like it would glow in the dark, so maybe I'll go with that theme a little bit and we'll see what we can find. All right, so I couldn't find too much that fits super well with this, but I figured something that looks good with the hood and then the shoes sort of match that pale green of the mask. So we got the LE low tops and the black inky rider. Let's give this a try, two more rounds with this one, and I will change the weapon again. This is a good weapon, but I want something that maybe could keep up with the competition a little bit more. So I'm thinking, hmm. I feel like honestly Splattershot Junior could go pretty well. I figure we'll do more splat zones this time. Let's hop back in and let's continue. All right, our first round with this gear is gonna be at Brownwater Springs again. All right, well, let's give it a try. So let's head over here as much as we can and see what we can do. What is our bomb? We just have a normal splat bomb over there. I think I'll back up. Just try to get enough stuff for a shield because we're in control. So if we could just get the shield out there without getting knocked out. Oh man, might be a little bit easier said than done. Stuff is exploding all around me. We're in control again. All right, no, 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 come on. Just gotta hold on for a little bit longer. Just a little bit, now my shield. Whoa, come on, you're kidding me. I get the shield up, but no one to protect. It maybe just delays the onslaught a moment longer, but not what I was looking for, that is for sure. We're back in control, even then, somehow our team is taking it back, so that's great. I'll get over here, and then I'll save everything I can for now. I know that they're running up on us, so maybe we can throw out the splat bomb. Didn't do too much, but maybe it still did, we just can't see it. I'll wait down here for a moment just to see if they plop down. Oh, okay. I don't know if they knew that was there. That was actually huge because I got rid of a Trizuka. Okay, shield, 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 shield. Just to cover up this one spot. Oh no, ooh, and then we can hide in it. Throw that up there. They're still trying to get rid of it, but it definitely makes it a whole lot more difficult. Okay, shield is gone. I'm throwing that spot bomb over there and then on the, ow, oh, get splatted by that guy. Just straight in the face with the Trizuka. Not good. All right, well, we're still winning this thing, even though uh, we're behind right now. Gotta keep going, like a monster from the deep. Take them under. Okay, waiting right here. Maybe just toss it up there. We're back in control. I see you over there. They're not gonna get very far. Wait a minute. Yeah, get rid of you. Plenty of ink to earn up on this side especially over here. So if we just do that a little bit, time for the shield. So I might just wanna get up here with it this time. Oh, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. Don't you dare get out of here with that. Okay, so at least that makes their Trizuka pretty unproductive. Ooh, and they focus a lot of their effort towards it, so I feel like that gives our teammates some room to do some other stuff. So that's always nice. With only 14 points remaining, they're gonna get pretty desperate here in a moment. So let's just try to keep our positioning in mind and see what they end up doing. There we go, that's game. Another swift victory here, this time with the uh, little Kraken themed faceplate. So we'll go with one more round with this setup and hopefully it goes well, but definitely liking the looks of things so far. All right, we're still shivery cold. <laughs> that really worked well for the first one, but not as much for these other two. All right. So with that one done, let's see what extra experience we get rolling in. Uh, nothing too crazy, I don't think. You know, we got two golds and a silver, eight more points. We're still, you know, pretty far from uh, getting any kind of rank up there. But the Swim Reaper does gain an extra point here with the ability unlocked, and the Black Inky Rider, and the LE Low Tops. Everything gets improved. So yeah, let's go for another round. With those improvements, maybe we'll do even better. All right, round two. Once again, we're on this map. I want to check out the other one, but it's not giving us that opportunity just yet. That's fine with me, though. We'll just keep going. Turn in the more wind. So far undefeated today. Will that be broken here? And the Swim Reaper be defeated. We'll find out. I'm gonna toss it over there. Maybe we'll get somebody. Maybe I'll put up the shield right here. That was a foolish thing to do because now I'm not defended by the shield and they are uh, not defending the actual point. So should have just held on to it. I'm gonna throw one of those as far as I can and let's get some other stuff filled out over here. Maybe it can work out on another one. Up like that, and then I see you over here, but do you see me? Yes, you do. Who has the longer range? Me, just barely. So I wanna get up here, cover this stuff up. 
There we go. Now we're in control. Hey, watch it. Whoa. Okay, not good. Try to get over here. Come on. Gotcha. So far, we're holding things up. But how long can we do that for? Where is my team? I don't know. Were they really held up there just by one person? That was ridiculous. I was just taking them all on. Okay. I want to just do this super duper quick. I know my team is working on some stuff over there, but if I could just get that shield built up again and actually get it on there, I feel like that'd be a big, big deal. They're doing it again, they're pushing us over here. We can't let that happen. I need to be able to get this covered up. Oh, very unfortunate. Come on, this is not good. They really started to take the lead from this one. We gotta get rid of that thing there for sure. This one player really just making it difficult for the entire team. Okay, they have their own shield. I'm gonna destroy that and then destroy you. Ah, oh, come on. This is not going well. I just feel like our team's getting really caught up here when that's not where we need to be. But I know they're doing what they can. That's all that matters. We are in control now, so I can maybe just toss over something like this. We lost control again, but if we could just get out there with our team. Where are they at? Right here. Ah, oh, come on, there had to be two of them. Right there, two of them right there. Ah. Oh. Come on. It's gonna go out again. Whoa. Uh, what was that? I don't know how I didn't get you there. That was very sloppy of me. I'm gonna toss it over in that direction. Whoa, they're gonna do the same thing to me here. Shield time. Okay, shield is up. Oh, come on, no. Every time I get somewhere, it just feels like somebody else is there to knock me out. And my teammates are still up here every single time. I just don't get it. Do they not know that we can jump off over here? Or they, are we just really getting held up by something? Okay, get that there. Go over in this direction. Knock you out, please. There we go. And then there's just more. Oh, this is just overwhelming. Okay, now they're jumping down. That's sort of good, but it's just not enough. Really struggling. Maybe it's just our weapon combos with our team here. Okay, no you don't. Okay, maybe you will. You are really good. Okay, hopping over this way. So many players, I just can't keep up with everybody. Splatting as many people as I can, but not really making the difference. We need to have only a little bit of time left here. If we can take it right now, that would actually be huge. That would actually be huge because we'll push them into a huge reserve, but instead, they don't have to deal with anything. Get up here super fast, like that. Get the shield, get the shield, come on. I would like to have the shield when I'm actually kicking, but it's not enough. Our team just could not synergize there, I don't feel like. Anyways, you know, I did what I could, but we don't win this time. Our win streak is broken. That's okay, we still had two rounds with this gear. It was pretty cool, so I think we'll just switch over to the last one now and see what we can do with that. But definitely a bit bummed out. I feel like we could have won that one. It just, things just weren't synergizing. Okay, so what we wanna do now is just back in here. I did get three gold medals though, so that's something. Get minus two points. We're still getting a lot more overall, so not really too worried about going backwards in that way. Let us uh, stop for now, and then I will change my gear and see if we can't find anything that fits a little bit better for our next thing, the bleak beak. Whoa, I played this fits with the leather jacket really nicely too, but I'll take a look around to see if there's anything else I want before I settle. Okay, I decided to keep with the black inky rider, teaming up with the green rain boots, just because I feel like it matches a little bit, I guess, and then the bleak peak. So we have two more rounds to go. I feel like we should reset a little bit. Maybe we'll do two more rounds of turf war um, to finish things off. Seems like fun to me. But before we do, also I wanted to change my weapon. Whoops, don't wanna forget about that. So uh, what do we wanna choose now? I'm thinking if we back it up a little bit, we could do something like the neo schematic, or I could also do Lots of options, lots of options. I wanna mine something a little different. Let's try the Rapid Blaster. Seems like it could be fun. All right, so another round of Turf War here. How do we wanna handle this one as I'm dropping my controller all over the place? Oh, this is not the weapon I thought it was. Okay, we'll try it. This is not the weapon I thought it was. I don't know why, but uh, that's okay. Blasters are still pretty cool. I'm sure we can cover up Turf with this and do okay with it, but it is definitely a whole lot more difficult than it was not Turf War. I don't know why I thought it was something else. Uh, that's okay. Oh, let's get up here. Got you a couple times, I'm able to get a spot with it, eh? Pretty proud of that. Awesome, so let's wait here for a moment, and then I will try to just, oh, whoa, hey, watch it. Oh no, they found me. I need to get a little bit around the corner. That's not working. All right, I'm just gonna throw these wherever I can and see if that helps at all. I don't know what our chances are. Ah, actually winning this, whoa. 
Just because the turf coverage isn't so high with my weapon, we also have a charger and a roller on our team. It could be a bit tough. Whoa, I see you up there. Not enough to splash you with that, unfortunate. Um. Uh-oh, uh-oh. A little too close for comfort, can't deal with that one. All right, well, hopefully our team can see that uh, somebody's coming in from this side. I'll zoom back over, and if we could get a height advantage like this, maybe it would do something, but I don't see them just yet. And luckily we're not in danger. Yeah, the mine's not helping my case very much with turf coverage. Whoa, okay, didn't see ya. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't know, I may have made a mistake. I'm so sorry, we'll probably change weapons between rounds. But with a minute and a half left, we just gotta keep going with what we got. I mean, so far it's not too dire. Like, it could be a whole lot worse in terms of how things are. We're not in the danger, so I think I will just get one of these here, refill a little bit, and just try to focus on splats as much as I can. So, I see you over here. You're gonna try to back up for me, and that's my chance to splat you. So, I'll take a trade, pushing them back a little bit more with it, too. Feels like a good idea. So, heading back over. And then plenty of turf spots over here. Whoa, that need to be covered up. How is none of this hitting you? Come on, are you serious? Okay, that got you a little bit. Uh, I'm really bummed with how little that actually did. I'm gonna charge up, pop up here, and then if I could, just get a little bit more turf covered, not get knocked out by you, please, 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 please. Uh, okay, you're down there now. Uh, you know what, just throw some stuff around. Throw some stuff around, see what ends up happening. At the least, I might be able to beat you up a little bit, and if not, I can just push you back, you know? There we go, I got one of them! I got one of them! That's all that matters! We might be able to win this one. Okay, jumping back over. I'm sorry, I know I'm pinging you a lot, but uh, just gonna get this down here. Get around the corner, maybe. Ah. I mean, I'm keeping them busy. The more they're trying to attack me, the less they're covering turf. I think we might have just won this one. I can't believe it. We'll see for ourselves. I think we did. That's definitely a lot of my team, but I feel like I contributed at least a little bit. 48 to 41, not too bad. So we're able to get a win with this one to start it off. Let's go ahead and change the weapon as soon as possible so that we can choose something maybe a little bit easier to work with. But hey, I'll take what I can get. All right, so 681 points there. Like overall, really not bad. But I don't wanna push my luck too much. We're gonna change our gear and go. So just weapon, change the weapon. Let's do something else. <laughs> Anything else, really. Uh, you know, I wouldn't mind, yeah, something like the Tri-Slasher could be fun. Let's try the Tri-Slasher. All right, our last round of the day will be with the Tri Slosher and the Bleak Beak. All right, our final round will be back here on Flounder Heights, this time with the Tri Slosher. This might be a change of pace. We'll have to wait and see. All right, so as we go through this, I would love to hear though, what are your thoughts so far on all of these different Splatterwing gear pieces? And they're totally free. All you have to do is go through the Nintendo News section on the Switch to get them and then open up Splatoon that way. I'm sure you can figure it out, but uh, I'm not very good at explaining it. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, pretty cool. I think it's always good to get some free gear, and it's just fun to see Splatterween back. Okay, let's wait right here, and then try to knock some of them out. I see you heading down there, trying to knock you out with that, but, oh, can I get you? Come on, did I, how did I not get them with that shot? Very surprising to see that, but I will just head over here as much as possible. Oh, I see you down this way too. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, you know what, you deal with that then, and I will get up here. Ooh. Look, I wanna make my moves careful. I get one, can't get the other just yet. Gonna hide right down here though. I don't think they're ready for it. Uh, they might be. Uh, whoa, I get one. Can I get two? We're getting some splats out here. Even if I get splatted myself, not too bad. I might jump over to this teammate's teleporter thing. And then we'll keep it moving. All right, so I will try to get up here, especially since I can cover up this stuff. Very nice, very nice. And then, oh yeah, this thing. Don't really know how it works exactly. Just get an enemy in there and they're probably easier to splat. I can guess that much. I think somebody had, whoa, hey, hey, watch it. Nice. Able to splat them too. Got some teammates out this way getting some work done as well. That's what we wanna see. I would like to get some height advantage on these opponents though, because if not, they will definitely 
Hunt me down a little bit. Putting this right here. Whoa, hey, watch it. Got you somehow. This is intense. Going around the corner a little bit. We're definitely giving them a super hard time. Whoa, uh -oh. oh no. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Okay, I'm gonna wait for them for a second. And then go for it, whoa. There we go. So far doing really good with the Tri Slasher. It looks like they might be giving us some issues back at our base. Gonna toss it over there. And then maybe just get back up here. Maneuver around here as much as I can. I got another splat. That's excellent, but look at all this stuff over here we can cover up. Let me get started with that then. Um, a little bit of trouble over in this direction. Okay, yep, they're in danger. Oh, wait, 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 don't get me. There, there we go, we got it, finally. I don't see too much going on over here. I'm just trying to cover up turf wherever I can. Oh, hey. Gotcha, I don't know how we're not getting splatted here, it's great. Working with my teammate now to get all this stuff covered up. It looks like they are bouncing back over here though, so we gotta actually cover up turf in this direction. They've been sneaking by. Oh no, actually, a little concerning. Have they turned this around on us right at the last moment? I see these guys over here, they might adjust. Ooh. I guess we'll see in a moment. We were holding them back at that base, but it might have not have been enough. It is messy, I don't think we did. I think they took it from us. Yeah, but by less than 1%, what a shame. Darn, I'm so sorry. I was trying to keep them back there, but they just ended up taking our teammates. All right, so a lot of wins, a couple of losses. Overall, not bad, I had a lot of fun. So I'll definitely take what we can get here. We, we, we were able to get pretty spooky here with all of our Splatoween themed gear. And like I said before, unfortunately, I won't be able to showcase the brand new Splatoon themed Splatfest between the Ghost Skeleton and whatever the third one was. Uh, but I wish I could. I just won't be home to do it, so maybe next year. We'll have the wait and see. But with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Splatoon 3. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.